Hey guys, we just asked that if you participate in our virtual programs, that you're doing it in a space that's clutter-free and that works for you. Also, if you're gonna be using materials from the home, just to make sure that a parent or guardian knows and that they're helping you along the way. So today's experiment kind of helps us visualize our emotions and how they build up, and it'll also help us kind of release those emotions. And all you're gonna need is a see-through glass jar or cup with some water in it, some shaving cream that's white or blue or whatever, but just make sure that it foams, and some food coloring. So as young caregivers, sometimes we feel our own emotions and emotions even from other people kind of weighing on our shoulders and it can kind of build up on us like a rain cloud, which is what we're gonna be doing today. This experiment is called the emotions rain cloud. So today we're gonna to see how much our shaving cream rain cloud can carry. You're gonna take your food coloring and do drops into the rain cloud, okay? And these drops are gonna represent your emotions, okay? So you're gonna see how many drops your rain cloud can hold before it needs to release. So as young caregivers, sometimes it feels like you can hold on to a lot of emotions for a long period of time, but sometimes it only takes a few drops. So I'm gonna try here and I'm gonna let you know how many drops it took for the food coloring to reach the bottom. So there you have it. My food coloring finally reached its way to the bottom of the cloud. The cloud couldn't handle it anymore and it needed to release some of its emotions. So this is where it's important for you guys to find that outlet that helps you release those emotions, whether it's using art, whether it's being physical, you need to find something that works best for you because it's gonna be different for everybody. So this experiment kind of helps us visualize the emotions that we're feeling right in this moment, but it also helps us visualize, you know, our internal rain clouds and that all of those emotions are impacting how much we can handle and when we need to release it in a way that's best for us. So let me know what you guys do when things get too much. When your rain clouds are about to burst and about to rain, let me know what you guys do to help you release those emotions in a positive way. I hope you all are enjoying the sunshine this week. I miss you all, and I cannot wait to see you guys soon. Bye.